All right, now we're gonna do the phone call test. So I should have a phone call coming in very soon. Look at that level. <laughs> Look at that level. Is that real? Oh, anyway. Okay, got a call, accept. I'm gonna make it go to my AirPods Pro. All right, there you go. Right there, 450 milliwatts meter squared, almost 500, and that's a centimeter away. I'm gonna put it really close, and it's broke the meter. <laughs> and these guys are going around 30 to 16 milliwatts per meter squared at around this much distance, but one centimeter away, it's dropped down to microwatts now. So look, that much distance, and it's microwatts. This is microwatts. And that's in a phone call. So even though these, I guess, I guess the main transmitter is this bit over here. This is the bit that's transmitting the Bluetooth. And this, I guess, is further away from your head when you're making a conversation. And the earbuds are a lot lower, as you can see. But with the Apple Pods, Oh my God, look at that. 300 milliwatts per meter squared. And let's switch over to Bluetooth. AirPods Pro. Hello, AirPods Pro. 300 milliwatts per meter squared. 250 milliwatts per meter. 350 milliwatts per meter squared. And. Uh, As a side note, the AirPods are a lot clearer on the phone if you're a visual than your Bluetooth headphones. That is uh, phone calls. Now let's switch over to music. So I'm playing music right here and I've got my AirPods. Pro right next to it. Come have a look at that. That says right there 450, over 400 milliwatts per meter squared. That's when you're playing music. Can, can you see that? 400, 500 milliwatts per meter squared. Now, I've also got some standard Bluetooth headphones and it's also playing music. And look at the levels right there. Green bars, it's microwatts. Not even, not even nothing. And as you can see, regarding the Bluetooth, both devices are connected. So 2,000 microwatts per meter squared with regular Bluetooth headphones. However, with AirPods Pro, boom, shakalaka. Oh, whoa, what's that? <laughs> it's broke the reader. <laughs> it's broke, it's broke the reader. <laughs> Check it out, there it is. Zero L, I've never seen this amount of RF in my life. And that is the pro edition of the AirPods. Enjoy the music. Subscribe for more amazing content. Make sure, because you don't get this stuff anywhere else. And if you're concerned about radiation, um, radiation has been linked to lower testosterone, even cancer, all this kind of crazy nonsense. It's actually on the official United States official health website. It said it's been linked to making cancer in rats. Now, rats are a lot smaller than humans, but the only way for us to test technologies out is on rats. You can't actually test it on humans. So we are the guinea pigs in this situation, but it's been, if it's been linked to rats, what's the likelihood it could happen in humans? It's probably highly likely. High highly likely. Why? Because rats are metabolically, is that the word? Very they're very yeah, close. They're very similar. Very similar. Very, very similar. Very similar to humans. Yeah. So just saying. I, I mean, if you, but the thing is, guys, if you do have one of these and you've spent all your life savings on this, I would probably just exercise caution because you probably may not be able to return them and you might be really sad or something. But just, you know, with anything, with any kind of cellular device or anything like that, just exercise some caution. Maybe don't use them all of the time. Also, another thing is don't get carried away with the hearing, the sound, because yes, it can, it pumps up some awesome music in the gym, whatever. But just remember, your hearing can also be affected with these as well. And secondly, if there's one takeaway point and you do want to be cautious with these, don't just stop playing the music. Literally, you have to take them off your ears because even when they're off, they're on.